Nathan, another man of the match award this evening, but I guess it's no consolation for the drop points. No, it's it's not. Uh, you know, we didn't get the win. I thought the guys came out hard, and uh, you know, we battled battled throughout the whole game, but we just didn't get the bounces. The team certainly have, seemed to have more energy about them tonight after a, what had to be said was a disappointing third period in Sheffield on Saturday. Yeah, absolutely. It was actually the same thing tonight that killed us uh, last night. It was just a matter of uh, uh, two or three minutes where we just let down and, and they capitalized on their chances. And you know, we can't we can't do that. We gotta we gotta learn to be consistent. And uh, and you know, we're not going to win games unless we learn to do that. And tonight was another tough physical battle on, from, from both teams. Right, I thought I thought both teams were, you know, both both tired and and you know that'll make you grumpy and and you just want to take it on the other team and and uh, you know both guys uh, both teams went at each other and uh, you know they were better tonight. One or two, shall we say, de- debatable calls from the referee this evening, particularly the uh, disallowed goal in the second period, a key point in the game. I I honestly I don't know uh, what he was watching. Uh, I, you know, I don't really have too many problems with with refs, but I, I thought he was uh, questionable. Uh, I thought I think is the right word. Um, it it was just there was nothing wrong with it. Uh, Bolt came around the net, wrapped it in, and and the goalie kicked the kicked the net off after the puck was in, and and you know he wasn't in position to make the call. Came skating down and said no goal, waved it off, and you know that was that was that was huge. We would have been up and. You know, potentially uh, hung on to that lead, but who knows? I guess it's a case of lick the wounds then this week. Only one game next weekend, but it's a tough one against Belfast, and uh, hopefully we'll have Tony, well, not hopefully, but we will have Tony and Stephen Murphy back, and hopefully Bruce Mulherin. Yeah, yeah, hopefully. Uh, you no, know, we missed, uh, missed all three of those guys um, this weekend. You know, we had Bruce basically the first shift, but uh, yeah, they're all key players, and, and we missed them this weekend, so it'll be nice to get them back. Well, good luck in training this week, Nathan, and uh, here's to getting back on the winning ways next weekend. Great. Thanks, Andy.